Alrighty then. Hello and once again, good evening YouTube. Welcome back to Pain and Suffering, Misery, and All of the Above. This is NASCAR 2005 Chase for the Cup. It's pretty, the situation's pretty dire. Hornaday is back 85 points and we still have to go to both Kansas and Atlanta. Oh, good. But at least there's an amazing battle going on in, in Featherlight, too, so we're not alone there. Still don't know how the uh, Cup Series is as far as uh, battles are concerned, but we are going to California this week. Honestly, I probably could have just qualified last in this race. But here we go. Guess we're going to qualify in the end. So, um, yeah, this is... Uh, so this is this situation as a whole is just not great. What we need is to dominate and win at Old Spice, Lowe's, and Darlington. That's where we're at at this point. We must dominate and win those races because I somehow managed to dominate and win Dover. Which is way more than I thought I'd do. Now I know what everyone's probably said in the comments is that Maybe I should practice these, pra practice these races beforehand, because if I actually did like a practice attempt of all these races ahead, I'd probably finish 10 positions better than if I'd actually, you know, if I hadn't. But you see, the thing is, where's the fun in that? All of my series have always been just going for gold. So I really don't see any reason to change up the formula just to try and get one championship that I'm almost certainly going to have a five-star contract for next season and will just destroy the field in. It's just a nice challenge to be able to get it in this version of reality. Because even though I won the truck championship last year, I still only had a grand total of one option for Bush Series this season that wasn't complete and utter dog shit. So no matter what happens, even if I lose the championship this season, I probably wouldn't have any better cars to choose from if I hadn't next season in the Cup Series. So we got the pull by about uh, three tenths, four tenths there. So it really doesn't matter. It's just a moral victory, just because of all the shit that you have to put up with in this game. Uh. I'm not in the mood for fans right now. I'm tired as fuck, dude. I didn't expect to be recording today either. That's the strangest thing. Is that this is an, an impromptu sesh. That's what this is. Oh yeah. Let's go! So yeah, we'll probably just destroy the field in this race like we always do, because that's how the uh, truck series goes. It's basically just a prestige farm at this point, because I, I did not need to run this season of trucks, but just doing it is just going to give me so much more prestige for free, is that basically it's just going to make everything worth it. Could you move your bitch ass, maybe? Alright, don't move your bitch ass. I guess we'll just fucking wreck your shit. Been going all over the goddamn track like a fucking asshole. I didn't even mean to do that. But he fucking deserved it, so I'm not mad. Anyway, so I guess we're gonna lead every lap in this race. Good shit. Good shit. Competition is non existent in this series, and I'm not complaining. Oh, good. Now I just need to figure out how to drive this track. Got a five-star car, can't even get around California right. Well, in my defense, I thought I could flat foot that, so... That's where that came from. Oh, we're three wide for the lead. Oh, God, dude, we're three wide for the lead. I'm in the wall like I always am, so this will be another race where I don't have a clean car at the end. Neat. That's neat. That's all I ever asked for. Is that maybe we can just do one of these races without getting any damage? Well, so much for that. God damn, dude, this thing don't turn. If I could just go one lap without someone on my inside, that would be great. 
I mean, it's nice to have competition in this series for once. I'm sure the fans are happy to see that, like, 15 wins on the season. Michael Annette's actually struggling for once in a race. Okay, what is up with this truck? Why is it so terrible? Okay, and we're wrecking. Cool. And we're still wrecking. Anytime you're ready to stop wrecking, that'd be mad. That'd be marvelous. What the hell is up with this truck, dude? It's fucking horrible. Just don't turn. Oh, and here comes Jason Powell, here to make my life fucking miserable, I'm sure. Yep. Guess what? Someone's on my inside. This is supposed to be the easy race. This is supposed to be the race where I can do virtually nothing and still win. Am I gonna have to take two on this shit? Am I gonna have to take two fucking tires for this shit? Well, we're pinning, so... And I'm thinking I might get a speeding penalty, so I'm gonna have to take two no matter what. Cool. Nate, that is awesome. You know, if I could just not make these races that are supposed to be guaranteed wins, if I could just make it not the hardest on myself possible, you know, just to make, you know, the bush races that are actually supposed to be difficult, actually make those a challenge, you know, I don't know. Oh, cool, slowing feels, slow feels, slowest feeling animation. Great. I'm in new and I'm, I'm in no mood for this game shit. And I can't fucking talk to save my life today. Awesome. Just awesome. This is the best possible turn of events for everyone involved in this series. It's time to the page of the field. I think it might be time to the page of the field. So. How much you want to bet that these guys come down on me and fucking murder my shit this time out here? Yeah, um... Okay, Piglet, what are you doing, Chad Chaffin, or John Wood, or whoever the hell's in this truck? Is that guy- is he for position? Oh shit, Chap- shit, the, whoever the fuck this is is for position, okay. I don't know why I got so tight there. It looked like he was on old tires. I just came up the track, you know, but... Oh, that's interesting. Okay, sliding up the track some more. There is no wedge in this truck. That's the worst part, is that I have no wedge whatsoever in this truck, and it's still driving, like, absolute the absolute value of ass. Alright, so... Here's what I was doing wrong the whole time. I just had to actually race the track properly. So, we have found the solution to the problem. It was just driving properly. That was my issue. And the problem is solved almost pretty much. Oh god, that is Jason Powell going for the lead right now. No! I will not accept this shit. We cannot have Jason Powell winning a race. I am way too much of a... Gurmad rival with him. IRL right now. I don't think I have any rivals in trucks at this exact moment, but I'm about to. Come on, turn! Come on, turn! Cool, we're three wide like fucking always out of this. Oh god, it's the last lap! Okay. 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 Here we go. Here we go. We gotta figure this shit out. Right now, how we're gonna win this race. Okay. And, of course, there's someone on my inside. What's fucking new? Okay, we're gonna slam the wall, like we always do. Come on, get the truck. This finish is going to be stupid. Oh, this finish is gonna be stupid. Here we go. Why are we wrecking loose? Why am I losing spots? There goes John Wood for the lead. Okay, we're coming back on him, though. Oh, this is gonna be good. Here we go. I'm not gonna make it, or am I? I'm not gonna make it. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Fuck! God fucking damn it, dude. My second fucking photo finish of the season in this goddamn series. But I fucking managed to not win. Good. Just great. And that's a difference of like a thousand prestige points between third and first here, so. Could I have actually won that if I started last? I don't know now. I thought I would have been able to. Oh, look. I think this is the last showdown of the game. Getting it out of the way early, I guess. 
Getting it out of the way oily. Getting it out of the way oily. Yeah. 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 Okay, I'm just, yeah. Hey, this is Dale R. Jr. So I see a lot of fans out there wearing your colors these days. Hey man, let's hit the track, find out who's really the boss. I've got a sweet hot rod waiting for you on the line if you think you can beat me. Holler. Cool. I'm going to the stats, but it doesn't matter. Okay, this is Old Spice, right? No, it's Kansas. Okay, well we're getting the shitty race out of the way immediately. Great. Great, we're getting the shitty race. We're gonna have, we're gonna have that when I'm just not used to driving again. Cool. Great. Oh, that's fantastic. Ah, where's my rape whistle? 